Good kitten internet, let's get right back to it. Go ahead and load up. And we're just going to immediately move over here. Do, 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 do. Don't worry, everything will become clear soon enough. Go ahead and move straight over to the inn over here. Where we are going to recruit. Welcome, adventurer. Welcome indeed. We are recruiting you. Let's go ahead and cast a spell. You know, I like wizard eye. Mm, nah, I don't want to do wizard eye. Excellent. You know what I want to do instead? Fly. And I'm gonna go this way. How long is fly gonna last me? One hour? Should be plenty. Come aboard! Anchors away! Alright, and that's it. We've already completed the entire first section of the game. So now I'm actually going to do it the right way. So what I just did is show you... This was the final released version of Might Magic 8 for reference. There are no patches for Might Magic 8. Official ones, that is. There's definitely unofficial patches. Um... Might Magic 8 is a bug-filled mess, and that's what I wanted to get across for this little section. Um, I just skipped over the first 15% of the game, basically. Um, maybe not 15%, that's an overestimate. I just skipped over the entire first arc of the game. I skipped the tutorial island. I did that because the game doesn't know what to do by default if you select wizard eye switch over to water magic Excellent. and click quick spell it for some reason changes which one of these spells it has highlighted and as a result who the quick spell is fly so now let me actually start the game so let's go ahead and quit i'm gonna edit this video together so i can record the second part now be right back all right, we're back again. We're actually back at the real Might Magic 8. If you didn't notice, that was also not upscaled. I don't think you'll be able to tell the difference, but it's very obvious to me when I'm playing in a 640 by 480 window. So anyway, as we were doing before, we're dropping intellect and luck. We're increasing personality as much as we can. And we're going to increase endurance by 5, or 4, up to 15. And then the rest in the speed. Me. You want I can help? I am the best. And choosing I am the best. Launa. Sure, you know what? Launa is our character. Hello, Launa. So, this is not Raven Shore. I've never seen one before. He's, you've never Excuse seen me. the guard that you came with. So, here's what's going on. You are on Daggerwound Island. This is the tutorial island of Might Magic 8. The main difference being that this island you can actually return to. And you're going to have to. Um, you arrived in a caravan. I don't know why you all have covered wagons when you're on an island. That doesn't make a whole bunch of sense, but whatever. Um, and then the cataclysms. The cataclysm started around this time. Um... And then pirates attacked, because why not? Um, everything is better with pirates. So um, we're talking about the Regnan pirates. You've seen it mentioned in Might Magic 6 and Might Magic 7. Might Magic 8 is actually where the Regnan pirates come from. So, uh, yeah. So there's pirate attacks everywhere. The pirates are infinite. They will constantly respawn. It's not even just a, when you go to sleep and wake up, they've respawned. It is literally spawning while you are there. You are a guard, you are hired as a guard for this caravan. Uh, Daedaros is the leader of the caravan. Yeah, the Regnan pirates are on an island very close to Jadam. Jadam's where we're at for reference. So, I... Add wasp mode enabled. What the heck happened to it? So these are trade goods for reference. So we can sell them. These are what potion bottles look like. Um, controls. Yeah, I can let me change the controls. K 
Okay, well, I'm gonna use not wasp, apparently. You know what? No, I'm going to save this. And then I will be right back. I'm gonna fix these controls. This is nuts. All right, and we're back. I, the registry key that I had for this was assuming a 32-bit computer and not a 64-bit one like what I have. Let's go ahead and look around and see what we have. So first off, we've got Launa, our cleric. She starts with some things. Maces are huge now, don't ask why. I really don't understand why a tip standard mace is what appears to be a meter and a half long. I've got nothing. That's cell bait. And then spells. Really don't get the Eastern European style accent. But, uh, very useful. but okay, you know, that's fine. So, we start with Bless and Detect Life. Remove Fear and Telepathy. Cure Weakness and Heal. What we don't start with is Light Magic. Since this game is mean. So we've got some stores. The finest potions available. Oh, you know, potion shop. I mean, these are standard stores. There's nothing special about the starting area. I can learn alchemy. It's not worth learning alchemy because we're just going to go grab somebody. We've got weapon shop. I'm going to learn bow, but I don't have the money for it right now. So what I'm going to do is grab some adventurers. But, oh, orange is useless for me. We're going to go hire these adventurers. As you may have seen from the previous video. I'm not going to cheat. Welcome, um, all the cheats are basically disabled as a result. So, this is the Adventurer's Inn. This is actually from early Might and Magic games, oddly enough. This is actually the way Might and Magic 1 through 5 worked. Um, so, we have Devlin Arcanus and Elsabeth Lamentia. They're both level 5. I'm level 1, for reference you mouse over them, you also see the number of skill points they have. So, Devlin, nope. That's a good one, then. A good seven. Okay, I don't get it. But anyway, we're going to end up hiring both anyway. But you can recruit more than just the five party members that you have, and they go to the inn. Which is really nice, because you finally have a method of permanent inventory storage. Because anybody in the inn will always stay in the inn and will never reset. So yeah. Oh, actually, let me... Oh, I was going to get their backstories. So, Elizabeth's backstory was turned in... And she was turned into a vampire by the guildmaster of the Necromancer's Guild. And she's now a freebooting adventurer. Um... Welcome, adventurer! Devlin Arcanus is a newly initiated practitioner of the Dark Arts. Some of these characters are strictly worse than others, for reference. The main reason why I wanted to grab these characters is that they're low level. So there's only one stupid mistake here of why would you throw two points into two different weapon skills? Whereas she doesn't really have any mistakes other than, no, I need monsters actually not that bad for her. Um, yeah. Hers are not actually that bad. So we can show off her spells. She starts with the same two spells for Mind and Spirit. And she also starts with Life Drain! So it does a small amount of damage for a large amount of spell points, but you heal one third of the damage done by it. So it's a Life Drain, you know, as the name says. Which, that healing and attacking at the same time, that's totally my jam. The spell is set. Um, Devlin doesn't start with any water magic for some weird reason, even though he has a skill. Um, we've got the standard firebolt, torchlight, wizard eye featherfall, no earth or water magic to start, and he starts with three dark magic. He starts with toxic cloud, which does crap tons of damage this early in the game, but it also takes up most of his spell points. Reanimate. Which, eh, reanimate's not a very good spell in general. But I guess it's useful in the beginning of the game. And Vampiric Weapon, which we didn't get to have in the last, in Might Magic 7, because we went light side. 
Vampiric weapon allows us to... It's the same thing as the fire weapon, only it's with the vampiric ability. It doesn't level up to speak of, it just casts faster. But vampiric is an awesome ability, and I'm okay with that. So vampiric weapon ability will likely be our primary form of healing for a little bit. Uh, what else we got? We need to spend some skill points. I have not looked up with any of the trainers are for reference. I probably should do that. But, eh. Oh, yeah, that's right. I am actually going to need ID item for once. I should throw points into that. You're going to... I mean, I guess that point in learning was kind of wasted, but eh, it's not that bad, at least. You're going to... Do that. For now. Okay. That well doesn't appear to do anything right now. We've got guards. We've got peasants. None of the peasants have anything useful to say, basically. Because you can't hire them anymore. Here's our expert air magic. We don't have anywhere near enough money for any of this, though. That's okay. We're going to remedy that money situation shortly. Expert leather. You'll notice that you get the little ding noise on the expert ones now. They did get... And th this map is actually a lot better than it was. Okay, so we sold our brandy. Yarrow is the Grandmaster Spear person. So we now have 757. Oh, the jumping thing's still happening. And the key bindings are slightly off. That's why I keep hitting the current quest log. But... See? This actually lets you know. By the way, the air magic expert is in the Dagger Wound Islands. My Magic 7 never told you where the experts were. Because the only way that you were able to get the little teacher location thing was by talking to an existing teacher and asking where the next one up was. In this case, we can actually get it through other means. Also, they actually tell you where Master and Grandmaster are now, which is very nice. Also, very nice, we've got maps. You'll notice that on the map is labeled where the expert trainers are. And here's the best part, are you ready? I can add to the map. We did so many good things with this game and then it fell apart. Ugh. So this is definitely the weakest game of the Might Ma or the newer trilogy of Might and Magic. So, um Tisk wants a copy of the Prophecy of the Snake, which is in the t Snake Ruins, which is connected to this island. Um, what you're supposed to do is go through the Snake Ruins to the other side in order to be able to leave. You already saw how to avoid that. Um, everything in this game is basically avoidable. The standard luck one. Which will get everybody's luck up to 17 in this game. is 15 in the other ones, I thought. Uh, white barrel is luck. Quest. So his quest is he wants you to fix the portals of stone. The portals of stone allow you to teleport throughout the island. You're going to need to do that anyway, so it's fine. And we need to go find Frederick Talamir. He's over here. So, yeah. Here's Frederick Talamir. He's a dick. He needs you to fix the portals of stone, basically, before he does anything. That's right, boo. Frederick Talamir is a dick. But you know what's fun to do? This. Whee! Also, you can see out ahead, those are pirate captains, so you can fight them. You just have to fly or water walk over. Boo kitty, stop trying to claw my arm. Um, They're kind of far away, and... The pirate bits are actually time-based. Hiss has a quest for us. Hiss thinks he knows how to stop the Mountain of Fire, or Volcano, as the rest of us would say. Uh, there's an ancient spell, but you need the Idol of the Snake. 
Oh, there's a lot of snake-based things, aren't there? Anyway, here's the armor shop. I'm ignoring the armor shop. Red barrel is might. I'm going to give that to my cleric for the time being. The Daedross is right here. So, all right. So this is the letter that you need to deliver to the Merchant Guild in Ravenshore. Ravenshore is where we arrived at before. So that's our destination. Um, yeah, that's his quest. We're not going to be able to finish that for a bit. So the pirates are basically using, hey, look, everybody went to hell because of this weird cataclysm thing going on. Let's go plunder. Is um, it, they're pir The pirates of Regna are very greedy. Um, yeah. Uh, got a quest. Take this crystal to Frederick Talamir. So this crystal is the way that you open up one of the portals. Watch. So we already have our first fetch quest, because that was fast. So Clan Leader Wonfang gave you the power stone that he was holding on to. It will power the portal on the southwestern tip of the island. Use it. Hold an image of the stone in your mind as you step onto the portal. You know, I have a power stone that will activate the portal to Abandoned Temple, and you have the one that will allow us to reach the island where the portal is. We joined forces. We could reach the temple with ease. What say you? Yay! Frederick Talamir is a cleric. This is why I was a little hesitant to start with a cleric, because, um... I, you recruit one really fast. On the plus side, I have 1500 XP, which is enough to level up. I'm going to do that later. Um, so Frederick Talamir is going to be a better version of me. I just don't like the guy, so I'm not too concerned about keeping him. He's got the other power stone. We're going to end up looting his inventory eventually. He actually starts with light magic, but I don't. I see how it is. <sighs> Anyway, um, what am I going to do for Freddy? That. Also, we could take a look at his light magic, and he has light dolt. Nothing wrong with it, it's just kind of boring. But yeah, we can fire cannons. It doesn't really do anything, for reference. There's some crops here that I start drowning inside of the marsh. This game. I'm going to grab that barrel. We still have double speed, which is good. Um, yellow barrel. Accuracy. So yeah, the main character is going to be a little weaker than the rest of the party for a little bit because everybody else starts at level five the lowest level that anybody starts at is five we'll have to keep that in mind got another quest but this quest is you have to click twice basically you need to go cure some diseases he gives you one cure disease scroll and you need four because they're poor here Fine relics and curios. yeah except I have three. Sorry. Sorry, he gives you three, not... I'm tired. It's been a long day. Hey, um... But what I really need to do is... Over on the other side of this building here. Oh, let's also hit these. Orange. Orange. Also, why don't you actually cast Wizard Eye for us? Aha! <laughs> That's not the quick spell or quick save slot. So let's go ahead and save Have a seat. We'll be right and play some Marco Mage. Aw, yeah, you know it was time for that. We don't have to get a deck in this case. Apparently, everybody just has decks, as you do. Um, the rules of Marco Mage are the same. I didn't look at what I needed to do. Oh, well. but some of the cards are a little different now. Looks like we have the same audio glitches, unfortunately. Uh, players with the lowest wall will be me, so no. 
Looks like the gold was only 30. Oh. How about I just killed him? Hey, it was the thing that I tried to do all the game the last time in Might Magic 7. And I did it on the first try. Yep. That good. Now I actually have money, so I can get some expert wizard eye action going on, which is what I wanted. Alright, I'm used to that button being jump. What is it? Is it F? Yeah, it's F. You were air magic, right? No, you're leather. I don't need leather armor upgrade right now. I want air magic. There we go. Problem solved. Go ahead and recast wizard eye while you're at it. Now you can see items on the ground, and that's important here. Because we're going to be fighting our way through some pirates now. Um, yeah, we're not good at fighting. We're not going to be good at fighting. There is no pedestal of Day of the Gods here. Admiral Nelson, you do. So we're going to be island hopping, basically. And we're on the main island right now. Oh yeah, um, luck check. Because so I can, yep, I can get his luck higher. Let's bump up his luck, even though I'm not going to keep him. Oh, temporary intellect, that's nice. Doesn't do much, but it's nice anyway. This one orange? Yes. This is the well I want to drink from. Frederick, you're a dick. So it gains you up to 16 luck. Okay. That's good to remember. So anybody who's creating a party, you should drop your luck to 9 or 7. So these two storm stone portals will become active once we actually, you know, activate them from the other side. This one, on the other hand, lets, we, lets us go down. And now you get to see the fight going on. We're not far away. We just walked over the other side. So we've got Lizardmen soldiers versus pirates. These pirates are wimpy, put it mildly. Sometimes there's stuff in the landing crafts. You have to be careful, though, because you will spawn pirates. Okay, I'm going to actually switch to turn-based mode. Uh, yeah, you should actually heal yourself. And... A holy dolt. Okay. Our party is terrible at fighting right now. Just letting you know. Um, but Toxic Cloud kills everything dead right now. Yeah, we're just terrible at fighting. Toxic Cloud still kills everything dead, but we only get like four Toxic Cloud shots right now. We're going to run for a moment. Because we need a little bit of... Oh, wait. I don't have any bows. This was not smart. Also, I should mention that there's meteor swarms constantly hitting the island. As you do. I'm just looting bodies. Hello. 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 By the way, the guards also respawn. It's basically just constantly respawns of everybody. Which is why I'm looting bodies. I don't care. Meteor fragment. So. The plot of this game is not obvious until a little bit later, so I'm not going to be talking too much about it yet. Oh, right, I forgot I'm squishy. Ready. I'm not used to playing such a low, weak party anymore. Okay. I mean, you saw my last Might Magic playing. I, I was playing a stronger party. But yeah. The general idea is that this is supposed to get you used to combat and to make sure you don't do stupid things like wander into a bunch of dragonflies that would kill you in the normal game. 
And by normal game, I mean ma magic seven. I don't know why I said normal game. So you can kind of pick them off one at a time this way. Just because, well, there's not that many of them. And remember, whoever gets the last hit is the one that actually gets the XP. Help me! Why did you die from hitting me? Oh. This could be tough. I did not mean to use my blood suck. Nothing. So yeah, this area you really need to use Wizard Eye just because enemies are constantly spawning. Like that! You saw it spawn behind. Dumb. Why we're ignoring it. Why you can't clear out this island yet. Um, a plot trigger later on will stop the invasion, so we've got a while. Here's our Alchemy Grandmaster. And the Alchemy Grandmasters will tell you what the Expert and Master are as well. We also have expert trap disarm. That probably would have been useful to learn. Oh well. Expert bow. Piffle. Who will give us a potion of pure speed as long as we give him the ingredients. So if we give him all of the ingredients, which is... What is it? Uh, slug. Um, the basic ingredients. That's all it says. That is not useful game. Basically, we need a bunch of these. And last hut. Yet another quest. We need an antidote. We need an anointed herb potion. So we have to go to the mainland, get the potion, then come back here. Master ID item, which again, we're actually going to need ID item for once. We picked up a sword, didn't we? I just don't know. It's worthless. Yeah, it is worthless, but you know. That does 2d4, that does 2d2. Technically the staff does more damage. That is sad. Because we're talking about the worst items in the game. Picking up a couple of reagents. You have to be careful because meteor swarms can drop on your head at any time. That's why we have wizard eye up. This is why we will maintain wizard eye and we will keep maintaining wizard eye. By the way, how are you? I'm talking a lot tonight. Yep, that was with meteor swarm. So this is one of the platforms in question. This one teleports us to an island where they're occupied. Um, what? Okay, there we go. It's like, why are you not attacking? I don't have any AoE sp No, I'm not going to cast that. That's dumb. Um, what? I'm casting heal. Aim. You can cast bless. Only affects one character at a time right now, though. Telepathy will give me money and item idea. Detect life will give me how many hit points they have. Um. Yeah, we really don't have the right party for this, by the way. I'm going to switch to Firebolt so I can actually, you know, serve. We at least have clerics, so this is less of a problem. That was too easy. And pirates are weak anyway. You'll notice that these are the basic level of pirates. The game is trying to be a little easy on you. Even if you have an all-mage party. One damage. One damage. Ah, ridiculous. I'm 
again, lucky that we have clerics. Because, oh boy, is Fred or Devlin weak. He's got 28 hit points and 7 armor class. Almost as bad as me. I seem to be focusing on him, which is probably for the best. I have zero armor class. Oh, I miss having hit points and spell points and useful anything. Oh, that one actually wasn't in. Brat. I have never seen one before. Yes, that would be because you've never seen anything before. You're a neophyte. Love how I'm using a cleric for ranged attacks right now. There's some power. No, this it isn't. could be tough. No. It's only tough because we're terrible. This is ridiculous. There. On the plus side, we will never have hirelings taking our money. On the minus side, we will never have the bonus of hirelings. Agent. Chests. Let's save. We've got a troll of shield. There's our fourth cure disease potion. Our troll. And money. We got a helm. You're gonna wear the helm. That's cell bait. Cell bait. Fifth cure disease scroll in case we have disease. I should probably start sorting people's inventories. Six cure disease. They really want you to cure, cure disease. That's gonna be useful for you. That's gonna be useful for you eventually once you actually get armor. Isn't it nice that nothing's trapped? Okay, so you can trade up on daggers. Also, we've got a purple barrel. Purple is speed. How are people's speed stats? 12, 19, 16, 14, you're getting speed. Not getting speed is the, anyway. Yep, we prepared the portal of stone. Here's the expert merchant. And cure for yellow fever. Each of these huts need the cure. Also expert body magic. I have enough money for, so I'm gonna do it. And it's this one's the last one. Yeah. An expert plate. They actually did that early enough. <sighs> okay. We repaired the portal. This is the Temple of the Snake, by the way. We get Fire Resistance Pillar. I think that's about it. No, we also have this Game of Accuracy, which all of us will fail horribly. Because we don't have anywhere near as high of an accuracy as we need. Increasing I've speed. Never seen one before. You've never seen peasants. You're an idiot. This could be tough. No. By the way, the barrels aren't... I don't think they're actually randomized in this game. A hunch. I'm not certain. For bodybuilding. We don't need right now. There's five. Was there six total? There was. Okay. So we're actually going to need to head back to the island, but I'm just going to loot this area first. Also, this is the edge of the map. What is over there? I want to know. <sighs> that one's not a complaint about Might Magic Gate, at least. That's just darn I want to know. 
Okay. We've got this stuff. Let's walk back, complete quests, then start this dungeon. How am I doing on time? Half an hour. Plus the, like, three minutes of the previous stuff. So that's not too bad. Let's double time this. Okay. All right, wrong button. So, um, Cure Disease Scrolls, we need to go to Iceland. Iceland! And we might have finished Thistle's quest at this point. Thistle. Thistle? Thistle! Nope. We need some more ingredients. Okay. Oh, our wizard guy went down. So many dead bodies. Yeah, they they will keep doing this infinitely. There is no end to the carnage. Well, there is an end. Uh, we will trigger something that will cause it to end. But there's an infinite number of people on both sides, basically. For reasons. Okay. Um... We got your gear. You need to learn leather. Because I need to make sure you have armor. You're also supposed to get that helm that I picked up. Look how dumb that helm looks. It's not even on her, it's in front of her. <sighs> they did a really sloppy job with the game and it bothers me. My apologies for harping on that. Which one's supposed to be our merchant? I mean, it's going to be you temporarily, but, um, I remember who had grand, oh, that's right, it was Dark Elf. That explains why we don't have a merchant right now. Anyway, I'm going to try to upgrade some things, and then I will level up. Okay, um, weaponry is garbage right now. Oh, I screwed up. In for some training? I can level up to level 5 maximum for reference on this island, and I'm already almost halfway there. Uh, there's a person at the entrance to the temple. I should have picked him up, then head back here, but oh well. Um, time is 3.35. I don't think I'm going to be able to make it. I'm going to save here. And we're just going to equip our characters here. I'll ready you for battle. Weapons. Bow. You don't have enough. I mean, her having a bow is kind of the most important I'll ready one. You for battle. Not that I have any bows to buy. Should have noticed that. Uh, no, you can transfer over to idiot boy over there. Tiger wound oddities. These strange devices appear as stone squares set in the ground. Abandoned temple. I've uncovered an engraving which seems to indicate the abandoned temple to the northwest island connects underwater to the island to the very northeast. The builders must have possessed very advanced construction techniques known as they didn't care. That's selling. That's selling. That's selling. Sell bait. Sell bait. Cell bait. I'm keeping the armor and shield for the time being. Give it to someone who can use it. Uh, the only people who can use it already have a shield. This is going to be trade bait, so that's not going to go anywhere for a while. That is potion, 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 potion. Uh, we're, we'll go ahead and sell that and that. Mind resistance is cell. Stone skin will be a keep. Deadly swarm I'll keep for now. Mind blast. Cell. Alchemy. Fire aura. Fire resistance. Torchlight. Fire aura could actually be useful. All the rest of that is cell bait.
and attempted to buy that, actually. Because that is a much better weapon than the mace that I have now. Yeah. Here you go. Now it's only like a meter tall. Oh, I should actually sell that. That would make sense. The magic item shop is yeah. Of knowledge here. Oh no, this is where you buy magic. You can buy all basic spells, and you can learn learning. We have nowhere near enough money for that. Did I already get this barrel? No, I did not. Oh, dare I. Oh, I didn't even check the expert earth magic sitting there. Oops. Have a seat. We Near be right the with you. shop. Items must be over here. Yeah. Trying to hit it before materials. it closes, sorry. Alright. Okay, I've got a little bit of money now, just not much. Oh, they actually had a club here. They did sort of fix the club glitch, but not very well. I'm picking up the club. 80 items, skill plus four. That's not terrible right now. Is it? Not that I can afford it, but just in general. Oh, beginning game. Oh, I've not really missed it. All right. You, yeah, you've got nothing. You're going to switch to club with no shield. No. You're going to use club for the time being. You're going to use the hammer. And let's see if we can quickly level up. I might have just finished my time, unfortunately. Aim for some training. Good. Got it. I don't have money for anything. Good job. Yep, leveled up twice. Throw points in, I don't know, magic, I guess. What are your spells again? You have no offensive spells, right? Right. Um, Spirit, so I can get up to expert there, is probably not a terrible idea. Neither is body. We'll do body for now. Oh, leather armor probably would have been smarter. Oh well. Let's go back. <laughs> Wrong one. That's not the jump button, me. Hi. Let's not go in double speed doing that. That would be a terrible idea. Help me, guard. Why loot all of your comrades? One hit point wonder. Stab. Fell into the water because reasons. Berries. Sure, I'll deal with one. Yeah, look how f often I'm hitting with that club. Ah, club classic. Now all I need to do is get Fire Aura on it. Ooh, I can do um, Vampiric Weapon now that I think about it. I have that spell. Devlin doesn't have Fire Aura, right? Right. Anyway, let's go back to running. Also, let's actually hit the tip of the island. Oh, it's... I think there was anything important down here, though. Oh, that's right, treasure chests. See, I really don't understand why they're not attacking me. I'm just going to move around the edge for the time being. Since none of this is trapped. And cure disease scrolls, because we needed more of those, apparently. Did we actually finish that quest? Oh yeah, let's not dilly-dally around there. 
Also, campfire has food. Um. No, we didn't. Dang it, me. Well, it's easier to finish. I'll finish it that way. Uh, I'm wasting time. Great. We're going to go back. Oh, hey, look, they're invading. Anyway, where are you, Aslan? There. Due north of me. Yeah, the lizard people have arrows. I don't, though. I nearly I've never hit the guard. Seen one before. That would have been bad. We'll go with bad. Aslan. Yes, I have. You didn't level up anyway. That was a waste. Rumble. Although I have money now. Money will help. Never mind. Hi. Hey, leave the stupid villagers alone. They're idiotic. Okay, um, what could I get? That's Arms Master, that's... Oh, dang it. Arms Master, Expert Body Building. Expert Body. Yeah, we should do Expert Body. For stuff I can afford. Um, actually, we should do merchant before I Have forget. We'll be right with you. You don't learn merchant there. You learn it at a temple. That's right. They have a bank. The someplace safe. Yeah, banks are even more useless in this game than the previous ones because this game is actually easier than the rest of them. If you didn't notice, uh, temple is here. How may we serve? Merchant. Yeah, we'll be keeping this vampire, so. Most likely. Okay. Walk ahead. Got that. Go deal with this butt monkey. That was too easy. How are you today? Heal up a little bit. Okay, got that much. Um, what we dropped. Weapon-wise, I could probably use a better knife. I'll ready you, for battle. you don't have a better knife, do you? No, you've got better staves. So, like, two more damage. This is sad that I'm buying that. Okay. Let's go back. Oh, we should actually loot these. Because trade bait is useful. Those are sealed crates. We already looted that. Ah, there's more. I did not mean to move that over there. Okay. Just looting all of the stuff that we're supposed to be trading. It's great. Also, gotta love the lack of music. Ugh. Okay. 
The uh, rest of the trade goods were here. Let's go finish that up really fast. And we'll run back and start this dungeon. Okay, it's something. Yay, funny. Yeah, the trade good actually makes sense in this game. Oh, we lost a guard. A pair of guards, it looks like. That's why swimming is bad. This island doesn't respawn, by the way. Um, once you get past the first island, none of the rest respawn outside of the typical timer for respawns. Right, we walk up here and. What will we find? Hello? Ah, someone else who's seeks a way off this accursed island. My name is Simon Templar. I have found my way to this temple and I was told this is the way out. Let's travel together. So this is the way joining normally works is that you're asked if you want to join or send them to the inn. Uh, we want them with us because we might as well. There's Nex here, by the way. So Simon Templar. Oh, he actually does start with armor. For some reason, I thought he didn't. So this guy has a little bit of everything. Luckily, he wasn't a dumbass and put points in plate and chain, but he was a dumbass in putting points in spear and sword. That's less of a problem, at least. We're just going to set that up now. Okay. Um, I'm actually going to put her mace on him. He will be doing four to six points of damage, but his recovery time is 33 as opposed to the, oh, that's unarmed. Um, as opposed to the 88 of Mace. That's actually not that great, is it? So four to six at 33. Mm, that's definitely less than triple. It averages less than triple. And let's compare with sword really fast. Sword is even slower than mace. Er, sword is slower than spear somehow. Boy. You know what? We're going with it. Let's do this. So. We've got some snacks nearby. Let's deal with the snackretaries. We don't want to fall. Falling is bad. You can actually see some of the enemies now. And they have ranged attacks because of course they do. Too easy. Yep. So these are our enemies. I don't know. Too easy. They're really oh, easy. They're pretty at least. I will give them that. Wizard eye dropped. Like to know when I'm being attacked on two sides. Ah, Simon has a bow. Lucky bastard. Is he actually better with the bow than I am? Kill bow one. That's accuracy 15 versus 11. Yes, he is. Taking care of those do goobers. Head downstairs. Oh yeah. It's people like seeing, apparently. Actually cast torchlight. Okay. First puzzle. I'm gonna run until this is prob I'm probably gonna just finish the dungeon, let's be honest here. Okay. F is jump. Oh, that was a mistake. I mean, I might as well kill them all. No on that. Even the full-size ones are not exactly that strong. Yeah, the young ones have three hit points. The full ones have six. 
and they occasionally drop gemstones. You have to hit them in a specific order. And then you have a stairwell. Otherwise, you can just jump across. That's actually what I've done before. Let's see if I can. I always mess up. Oh, well, doesn't matter. Oh, yeah, we should heal. Yeah, you can't change the order of these until you go back to an inn, and your main character will always be the first character. Curses. Yep. Oh my. Old scroll. It is inevitable. Our temple is lost to us. Never did we think that our own creations would turn against us, nor did, I, nor did we think that they could so handily bring about our annihilation. Only I and my assistant, Kukluk, are all that remain of the relic ward. <coughs> this note is for any of the keepers of the true vision who come to reclaim the temple. Kukluk and I have secured the holy idol. Remember, it is in the sixth plate, not the fourteenth. We lost warden Rishdrak. When that mistake was made last, I only pray our defenses will hold until you arrive. But yeah, we're fighter trap disarming, by the way. Uh, we don't necessarily need to. Oh, I forgot. You're the wrong character. Uh, I am definitely going to need to work on this order thing because the order of these characters are terrible. Save before we make a bigger ass of ourselves. Watch out! Prophecies of the Snake. That was a quest item. All right. What do you break? Nothing. Oh, yeah. You actually have something that's sellable. Well, you're going to sell it. You've got leather gloves. We're just going to transfer that. And heal the idiot. Eh. Devlin's not an idiot yet. That's later. And no, they don't have personalities or anything. I'm kind of giving them personalities. All right. Let's continue on. Oh, let's let people other than me see and then continue on. I already know that there's baddies in here. So. You can definitely tell that there's something above us. Let's go down here first. Empty this out of enemies. That was too easy. I have never seen That's a one winged before. serpent. It has 13 hit points. So, we've got another puzzle room, which is fine. I just wanted to clear this out. And you can see from down here what it is, is that you need to look up and follow the path of the red line. You can see from down here where the open spot is. You can't see from up above where the open spot is. So when we go back up here, everything looks normal. So what we need to do is walk like this. Otherwise, we will fall. Speaking of falling, let's cast Feather Fall now. Because that is inevitable because I am impatient. I wasn't even paying attention. <sighs> I'm getting lots of email. I should probably check that at some point. Oh, hey, look, the game's going, hey, idiot. F is jump. Oh my. Oh my. Again, this is the tutorial island, basically. Mm 
as I try to jump with the party. This is a find. That's better than what I have now. On the one character with plate armor. So might as well equip it. One character. Okay. Got one of them. Let's hit the next chests. And technically I could use telekinesis if I had it, but I kinda don't. This one's easy to reach. I'm just going to heal up more first. I like having two healers, by the way. Healers rock, after all. I really need to do that video about healers rock. Look out! I don't know. Okay. You're our ID item person right now. It's worthless. I would agree. It's worthless. I don't Agreed. know. Well, that means it's not worthless if you don't it's know worthless. about it. It's worthless. I don't know. I'm not sure. Well, you are. I don't know. Going to wear that unidentified cloak. How many healers? Okay. Next one of these. Darn it, I keep using the wrong button for jump. Okay. I hate that. Yeah, I don't blame you. I also hate that. I hate that I'm doing this. I want to be off of this island by the end of this video. Or at least ready to get off the island. Alright. I don't know this. We've got amulets. Neither one of them are any good. So cell bait. Another club. Hell yeah. It's worthless. Water walk is not worthless. That would have act Water walk scroll is actually enough for me to get off the island without having to go through this dungeon, but I'm going to go through it anyway. It's worthless. Your poison's not worthless right now. I can't cast it. It's worthless. That's definitely not worthless. You shut your mouth. Starwalk. Okay. Fall down. Rush back again. The game must be like, seriously, you guys are terrible. Right. Heal up again. Oddly enough, those two are the only ones really injured. Ow. Ow. I just don't know. That's a nice sword. I don't know. That could be useful. It's worthless. That's not worthless because none of us have helms. Agents. It's worthless. Charm scroll. Okay. Let's see if this does anything. Yes, it does. Plus one personality. Tried, okay? You are going to wear that. Helm. You're going to wear the dumb helm. I can't identify it. Uh, let's see. Him. Let's take a look and see how much damage it does. 5 to 25 at 117. So... It's nearly quadruple or less than quadruple the damage. It's not worth it right now. But I'm going to hold on to it. Okay, we're finally through that stupid area. To be fair, I'm the one that slowed it down. But. Alright. In here we find nothing at the moment. I miss one. Oh, it's still going even in turn based mode. Well, 
let's try this again. So yeah, this is a puzzle room. There's a lot of those. The buttons don't activate until I hit the door. Thought it was just turn off all of them. Why are you not closing? Oh, there we go. Ugh, I was probably just impatient again. Like, I know how this one works. Hello, everybody. Yeah, we're not going to stand in the hallway here. I don't have the club equipped right now, do I? Now I do. Nope, not you. You. I'm not used to having to... My brain, for some reason, thinks everybody's won over. Oh, wizard eyes down. There. Hi, everybody. There's a party and everybody's invited. Especially all of these pretty winged serpents. So, yeah. This is another one of those trap rooms. Okay. Where if you touch the red spots, bad things happen. So we're just not going to touch the red spots. Make sense? Basically, all of these things over here fire on you if you touch any of the red spots. to demonstrate because I think I can click on it. Nope, won't let me. I'm just going to go into here. Uh, we should also heal. Oh, you are actually done with your healing. Okay. We should be a little more careful because I'm a little hurt and I'm out of... Oh, hey look! It's finally the second type enemy. Perfect men. This could be tough. They have a lot more hit points. We should use magic. Oh, that's a problem. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna die and have to reload. Hurt bad. Me. Yep. Let's just reload. We'll come back for that. It's because I have any perception at all. Perception's a lot more useful in this dungeon than normal. Hi, everybody. Once more, party invited. Oh, no. Um, all right, I don't have sparks. I should have bought sparks. Let's at least kill the stupid elder. Why should I know? There. Okay, this will do for now. I think we can just come back on this side. Because there should be... So yeah, we're on the edge of the map. But there is a little portal thingy down here. Huh? That way we can go back and forth without having to use that water walk scroll that we picked up. So, yep. There we go. Now we can teleport around the island. Yeah, you don't say anything. You just want to go back. Anybody have that quest? Deliver the letter, find a noted potion. Um, Hiss wants the idol of the snake, which we did not get yet. We have the book of the snake. Somebody else wants that. Who wanted the prophecies of the snake? 
Do we have a second page? No. I could have swore somebody had said that they wanted the prophecies of the snake. But I don't see the quest anywhere. This one of those glitched quests. Boy. I thought it was somebody over here. I'm just gonna finish that up and then end it for the day. Well, a couple people opened up at least. I don't have the idol. I have the prophecies. Grandmaster Regen. Talamir's hut. Talamir's with me. Oh yeah. Let's get your luck up. Anointed herb potion. There. Okay, that gave me potions of cure wounds. I suppose that's useful-ish. Now more people can level up. That's nice. Ah, you are the one that wanted Prophecies of the Snake, and I got the reward for that. Now more people can level up. Don't worry, our levels are going to get very um, spread out. Not that long. Expert Leather. Go ahead and level up, and then we will end it. It's closed. Oh. What time is it? 6.42. All right. We are not going to do that now. We are going to stop for now. Hope you've enjoyed this internet, and I will talk to you next time. Bye!